which comprised this line caused by holders are president at $30 billion sell-off. Research when the Bitcoin price declined from nearly $20,000 in December 2017 to below $6,000 during the first quarter of 2018, many observers blamed new investors whose snaky hands had never entered a true beer market. Well, new research from a blockchain analytic firm, Chainalysis, suggested it was long-term investors, hence colors from the years of holding through they may have been, who triggered this line and then continued to sell off into the deep, to the tune of $30 billion worth of Bitcoin between December 2017 and April 2018. This was an unprecedented sell-off and such an opportunity is unlikely to be repeated soon, the firm wrote in its report. According to the China analysis, those former holders largely sold to new speculators, not all the long-term investors, shifting the balance of the Bitcoin wealthy away from those with the demonstrated ability to hold through adversity and toward buyers who may not have the stomach for a multi-year beer market. The cuts against the conventional wisdom surrounding the decline, which said the fair weather investors, many of whom had bought Bitcoin close to its all-time high, had panicked at the first sign of a downturn and sold their coins while holders strengthened their grips in a preparation for a beer circle. Moreover, the influx of a new speculator has depressed the Bitcoin price since this user are far more quick to sell their coins than long-term investors. In fact, the reports note that the amount of BTC available for trading has increased by 57% since the sale of began in December. At present, the supply of circulating Bitcoin is split nearly even between investors and speculators. However, this sell-off did not come without a silver lining. Science speculators tend to own fewer coins than long-term investors. Bitcoin wealth is less concentrated than it was prior to 2017. Of course, they also tend to be less insulated to holding, which means that it will take more demand to move the price needle in a positive direction than in the past.